Harris, Trayvon Brumell. Brumell from the U.S. He's got tremendous He's a really good talent. I'm always a great Trayvon star. Brumell is one of the bright stars of the future. Brilliant, brilliant stuff. Trayvon Brumell has been dealing with nagging injuries. I don't know if he's going to run. I just don't know. My name is Trayvon Brumell, and I want to be the fastest man in the world. Whenever I'm in a down part of life, I love coming home. Coming back here it helps me remember what made me so hungry to be the best athlete that I can be. When I first seen him run, my very first time I seen him run, that's when I knew right then that you were going to be a, a track star. Well, I remember those days, yeah. Yeah. I remember that. Yeah. 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 It ain't like that now. It ain't catching too many people. <laughs> yeah. Everybody just as fast as you now. Nah, yeah. I don't believe that. You coming for him. You coming for him. Yeah. You know a lot of people ask him about you. Yeah. They ask me all the time, when he gonna start running, we baby get back up to the level that you're accustomed to. It's been two years now, and I don't know. All right. So it still, it scares the hell out of me. We still haven't gotten back to that level. When are we gonna get there? Trayvon Brumell, he was the world indoor champion in the 60 meters back in 2016. One of the top elite talents, that next generation. Still only 22 years old, already a world championship medalist, already an Olympian. He had a strained Achilles when he was in Rio. Watch Trayvon Bromel in lane three, his first race of the season. Clean start, he is out of the blocks pretty quickly. Bromel has the lead. Bromel there fading just a little bit. It's close. Trayvon Bromel third, 10.22. Will not move on to the semifinals by six one thousandths of a second. I know I was supposed to be at Worlds. I know I was definitely supposed to be there to try to get on the podium. It's something that I just have to sit and swallow and just deal with it. Oh! See, he was supposed to break both legs. Yeah, he was supposed to be both done. legs are supposed to be gone. <laughs> no, he no, look, uh, look, I'm like, I can do it too. It's so much easier for someone to relate to me when they actually came from the South Side. Be able to have the people back home who know what I've been through is beautiful. Who is that? That's me right there. Growing up, I've had serious syndromes. I remember you flipped and you came down yeah. like flat footed, and I remember you just like going down. Yeah, I tried. I remember I tried to stand, to stand up, back up, and I just and went back just down. Like, when I had these other injuries, people didn't back off of me. They they stepped away. They gave up on me, but. Throughout the injuries, my friends motivated me to keep pushing. All those guys are like my brother. That was a blessing from God to have those people. <laughs> That's one. I might not miss a shot. You might not make a shot. I may not miss a shot, I'm telling you. I might not miss a shot. Trayvon Brumell, how What's you up, doing, Cody? young man? How you doing, Good Coach to G? see you, darling. Good to see you. Coach G is definitely the start of my whole track career. G helped me get to where I am now. You see this young man right here? He started running for me when he was seven years old. He one of the fastest men in the world. I know when I was young, all the old guys who ran at these big meets would come back and they'd be like, hey, you know, I want to teach you what I've learned. In the community, we need that. Everybody get in the straight line, we're going to do the drills that way. Use them arms, use them arms. If I see a kid whose family don't have the finances or if a kid is struggling in any type of way, I can say something because I know exactly how they feel. I've been through everything they've been through. That's why I love coming home. This is where it all started. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have one more very special tribute tonight. 
We have our most famous gladiator of all time, USA Olympian. Please give it up for Trayvon Rodell. from St. Pete on the south side is definitely a big thing. We like family. They know that if anybody has, has their back, I'm always there. Living on the south side, you deal with the hood, you deal with guns, you deal with police officers. Seeing all that helps me think like, man, I really was built from all this. I, I know I'm strong enough to stand up to anything. Every time I've had a serious injury, I came back better. I broke both of my knees, I came back faster and stronger. When I become 100% again, it's gonna be scary to see what's gonna happen. Well, I need to focus on my strength, make this comeback, get prepared for the Worlds in 2019. I know my purpose. That's how we build. Like, this, this, this is how my ram will work, you know what I'm saying? It's all right, we're gonna make it happen. Oh. I seen enough to know that I can be strong in this world even not having a lot. It's gonna be fun when I get back. That's just the truth. I know what I can do. Whenever I come home and I just walk around the neighborhood, it's just nothing but flashbacks. Being able to step foot on the surface again, it's like, man, like I really made it. It makes me thankful for the things that I have, especially the people that I have in my circle that kept me from going down that wrong path. I've worked my whole life ever since I felt like I can get up and start running. I was doing everything that my family told me to do. My family stand behind me. That's what really helped me become who I am. I wasn't gonna let everything that my family struggled for go to waste. I've always supported St. Pete. Uh, I love the city to death. What I've endured, well, everything that I've been through was all worth it. It helped me become who I am. We could be that icon to those kids that's in the same situation growing up now. My city is my backbone. My family is my backbone. Like, everything I do is for them. This is the year of getting strong and returning to where we was. We're gonna change the game. Running away is easy.